Hey y'all, Ash here with the Red Rock Ranch. And today I wanted to talk about, just like the title says, fermenting honey and garlic. This is just a real quick video showing you how I did it and not a how to do it. So anyway, you want to start out with about a quart of raw honey. Uh, make sure it's good raw honey. The stuff in the store, it'll say specifically if it's raw or not. Um, and basically that still has all the bacteria in it, it hasn't been sterilized and, and killed of its, of its nutrients. Same with the garlic, you have to use raw garlic, you don't want anything imported, chemical free, um, good raw garlic, farmer's market garlic or, you know, um, just some good stuff. Um, I used about three quarters of a pitcher of peeled garlic. I don't know exactly how much that is, but that's a general, you know, maybe a, just under a half gallon. Um, I got a gallon jar here, and as you can see, as it ferments, it um, pulls the sugar out of the honey and uh, caramelizes as it's fermenting and it caramelizes the, the garlic. It becomes a superfood. And the way you know it's done is when it's sunk to the bottom. This one I've been stirring, <clears throat> but um, they, they take on a little darker hue. They're not that white garlic anymore. Um, they're kind of golden. And uh, they sink to the bottom as they get filled with the sugars. This is a, an airlock on top of this. So this has been in here since October 15th. And it's almost exactly three months. Every batch I've done has been right out three months. Is when you know it's done. Is when it's all settled to the bottom. Um, at this point, it's not going to be letting off any gases as it ferments anymore. And we can put it in the smaller jars. Seal it. You know, it doesn't necessarily need to be heat sealed. Just sealed. And um, give it away at that point. Um, once I open a jar, I keep it in the fridge just to make sure, you know, I'm letting in basically, you know, bacteria from your everyday air. Um, so you want to keep that in and, and keep it from getting moldy or any bacteria in it. But yeah, just, just a quick video. I haven't seen a whole lot on what it's supposed to look like when it's done. So I just wanted to put that out there so people know. Um, yeah, once, once it's, uh takes on all those sugars it's the superfood and it's ready to eat so hopefully that'll uh help if um, you have any questions please leave them in the comment section below and thanks again this is ash with the red rock ranch